can't tell you how moved I am to see all of my friends, all of my co-workers, and all of the people that have shown up today for what I consider a great event for Crossroads Hospital. I came here the first time in 1987 and stayed for a few years and left, came back again, and now hopefully I'm back to stay for quite a while. This is home, and my wife and I consider this our home. But this is a dream that we've worked on for almost 23 years, putting together a master plan that we've gone through many steps to be there. And a lot of you will remember a person that helped me in the beginning stages when we did this, and that was Earl Elliston. Earl Elliston was Mr. Foster. And I know Earl's up there looking down and as proud as he can be for what we've accomplished and where we're at and where we're moving forward to. And this is a dream that we can't think enough. Everyone here, our physicians, the board, the community, the employees, for all the hard work that's been done to get us to this point this day. And we're excited for the things that are about to take place over the next few months. Is it going to be tough? Is it going to be difficult? Yes. The entrances of the facility are going to change on a regular basis. The way we do things are going to change. But it's kind of like I told somebody the other day, it's like having a child. You have to go through nine months, but when it comes to the end, it's all more than worthwhile to what you get when it's over with. It's going to be beautiful, and it's going to be great. If you've not seen the pictures, you need to come up and take a look. We're excited about how it's going to be.